So I want to make a video while I'm driving um, to the airport about uh, why I have a course on copywriting and just to address a few things because I got a comment last week and people, someone was saying like, oh, you know, 95% of people fail as a copywriter and the only people that make money in copywriting are the people that sell courses to people on copywriting, which I want to just talk about this because it's like complete bullshit. Um, and maybe you've read comments the same or maybe you feel the same. Because um, I get the logic, like someone might be thinking, well, if you're making so much money and doing so well from doing copywriting, why would you need to sell a course on copywriting also? Um, so let's just break this down and talk about this um, and maybe talk about copywriting as well and how realistic it is as a career path because I think a lot of people are on the fence about starting and you know they want to make sure it's the right decision to jump into learning this new high value skill before they invest a lot of time and energy into it because I, I was the same <clears throat> and sorry I'm just I'm actually like looking at the road as well so I can't look at my camera too much but um yeah, so, like, the whole thing about courses, like, online courses and online education is just as valuable, if not, I believe, more valuable than, like, education that you would get, say, at a university or something that's accredited, which I almost think the school system now is, is almost broken, and online educators, online course creators, people sharing their knowledge on how to, like become financially free and make money on the internet is like crazy, crazy, crazy valuable. So when I say a high value skill, it doesn't have to be copywriting. High value skill basically means something that makes money. So, or something that makes money for somebody else. So this could be copywriting, it could be web design, it could be video editing, it could be photography, it could be photo editing, <coughs> uh, screenwriting, it could be anything. These are all high value skills, right? So you need a high value skill in order to make money and an income on the internet. There's like no really way around it. Like that's just how you, you, you need it. So this comment I got, which I've seen a few of before, it's not on just my channel, it's anyone who sells online education, which I think is really funny. It's like, oh, well, you know, why would you sell a course if you're doing so well with your own copywriting? Well, like if you look at the leverage you have with creating a course, right? And I'll just be completely transparent like I try to be on this channel. I make content on this channel to pass down my knowledge on my high value skill, which was copywriting, right? And for me to share my knowledge in, in the most leverageable way possible and, and impact the most people, an online course is the best way to get my information out, my knowledge out to as many people as possible <clears throat> versus working one-to-one -one with people, one-to-one -one with clients, right? I thought that would be quite obvious, but maybe it's not for some people. So, you know, if, if I build an online course or online community, which I plan to build very shortly, um, I can impact way more people at a bigger scale around the world versus working one-to-one -one with people. It's just a better use of my time. And that's generally why most people create courses. And I, I, it's annoying that online courses right now have a bad rap. Or, you know, some people seem to think they're going to get scammed or like, um, it's just like a, it's, it's a fad. Whereas the internet and social media um, is like the, ne the next generation of learning, right? Like I'm... People were asking me the other day, like, have you, you know, what gives you the accreditation to teach copywriting? Like, do you have like a, a qualification for it? I'm like, no, I'm just self-taught. Um, I believe that experience is way more valuable than a piece of paper that says I can do something. Like, I've been copywriting now for seven or eight years. Like, I know my shit of how to write stuff, like persuasively, and I, I can break that down and teach it to other people, which is why I created an online course, which is why most people do. Um, yeah, I've lost my train of thought. Where was I going with that? <laughs> this is what happens when I start like getting passionate about something. Um, but yeah, like, 
talking about copyright and it's been a real realistic career path. Um, where's my camera still on? Oh, it is, sorry. So the front screen's gone off. There we go. Um, yeah, copywriting has been like a a realistic career path, people. Like copywriting, understand copywriting is everywhere. Like everywhere you look, whether it is online or in like digital print or anywhere, you're being sold something, right? And most people don't understand this. And all this is, it, this is all copywriting. Like YouTube videos, uh, Instagram captions, posts, Facebook ads, blog posts that sell things, websites, banners, branding. It's all geared around getting you to take an action, right? Or buy something. That's literally it. That's copywriting. And that is not going to go away. For as long as humans are around, there will be copywriting available. Um, it's like copywriting is just understanding human psychology and persuasion really and communication that's it and if you can understand that you can apply it to everything in life not just copywriting right that's why it's I believe the highest value skill that anybody can learn whether you want to become a copywriter as a career or not like everybody should learn at least the basics of the fundamentals of communication right I mean that's just logical and if you disagree on that then maybe this channel and this video is not for you and you can go and find somebody else. <laughs> I'll just like, be real straight with you. Because I know there's a lot of people that will get up in arms about what I'm saying here. Like, right, you're just saying this and that because you want someone to buy your course. And yeah, to be honest with you, I, I don't really care if you join my paid course, which is in the description if you're interested. Um, it's a beginner's course I put together to help people get started and get their first few clients, right? It's, it's, it's just my knowledge condensed and distilled into a step-by-step -step program um, that I'm constantly adding to but regardless of whether you join that or not like go go and seek out a mentor or uh, someone to follow find someone who re you resonate with and just follow in their footsteps like the people that put online courses together they also do it as well to help people avoid roadblocks right if you go and try and figure out all this stuff on your own, in anything, it's going to take you longer to figure out things because you're going to come up against hurdle after hurdle. You're going to have to figure out, okay, how do I overcome this hurdle? How do I do this? How do I do that? And sure, you can find all this information on YouTube. Like, there's nothing new that I share in my course. There's nothing brand new and secret. But it's the fact that it's condensed and put into a step-by-step -step program so you can just follow it along and be like, right, this is what you do now. This is what you do next. This is how you do that this is how you do this rather than having to go and try and find all the answers yourself on YouTube which is just gonna take even longer why not just invest in someone who's already done it and just learn from them that's why I still spend an ungodly amount of money on online courses and educating myself through other people because it's the fastest way to reach whatever goal you want be it like personal training something in business life whatever it's the fastest way a hundred thousand percent so yeah, that's my thoughts on online courses and if you're on the fence about feeling like they're not as valuable as like a university education or whatever, then I would love to argue that point <laughs> and tell you otherwise. And that's the reason why people make online courses and share their knowledge online. <clears throat> Everyone you see on YouTube who is sharing how to do something is probably selling you something, be it a course coaching a product physical or digital they're trying to sell you on doing something right nope otherwise they wouldn't be sharing stuff on YouTube I can I can practically guarantee that um, and you'll start seeing it now I've told you so yeah anyway that was one of my little chats as I'm driving to San Francisco I've got a few hours left in my car so I might even record some more videos because it's good, good use of my time as long as I don't keep looking at the camera and make sure that my eyes are glued on the road <laughs> but uh, yeah if you've got any questions on copywriting or online courses uh, drop them in the comments below and let's get a conversation going and I'll see you in the next video